Hello everybody and welcome to another Power BI video. In today's video, we're going to talk about JSON files, theme files. So for those of you that are new to Power BI, it means that with a file, you can format the entire Power BI report. And I have a few videos on this theme, so go down below and check them all out if you want. So what we're going to do today is I'm going to show you how you can change the title of the visuals in one go. So we will change the color, the font, and the size. We will also, or I will also show you how you can change the background of the visuals and also the background of the page. I will share with you the uh, Power BI uh, theme file, the Corbel theme file, in case you want to reuse it. I will also uh, re share with you the Power BI uh, file that I have with how to build a JSON theme. Uh, I hadn't shared that before because it is horribly built, but you've asked me, so I'm going to put it on the members download. Go to corval.com, become a member, and you have it for free. Okay, so everything available. Now, let's see how this works. If you're new, very quickly, this is the Power BI Microsoft theme. This is the default theme. If you want to change that, we go here, I put my Kerbal JSON file, and you see that everything changes except for the title of the visuals, also the background and, and the background of the report. I normally have it white, but if you want to change that, I'm going to show you how. Okay, so how do we do that? This is the Kerbal file that I just uploaded, and it doesn't have anything for formatting those things. This is the Kerbal updated file that I did and the one that I'm going to share with you. Okay, so what you can see here is title. So it changes the title, it changes the background of the visual, and here it changes the color of the report. So let's load that up in here. Switch themes, import theme, and then we're going to import the updated one. See? All the titles change. I mean, this is a live saver. <laughs> My god. Um, I'm going to show you how this works. So here we have show title by default, and then here is the color. This is the color, the font color, and this is the background. I have the background white and the color blue. That's what you saw. This is the alignment if you want it to have to the left, to the right, or to the center. And then you have the font. I don't think the font is really responding. I think the single bold looks different, but don't know. And this is the font size. So you change that. Now here is the background of the visual. I have it white, but just for the sake of it, how about we, just so you see what it does, because if it is white, you don't see anything. I'm going to change it to blue. And then we go back to Power BI and we import, re-import that file. And you see what it does? It changes the background of all the visuals. Oh, that was pretty. It changed the background of the visuals uh, that way I'm in the map, the, the border for the map. It looks quite cool, actually. Um, it changes everything to, to the blue. And now you can change the background of the report too with the new settings on the JSON file. So you have to go here to do, 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 page here and change it to, I normally have it to white. So go in here, import theme, and everything will become blue. Horrible looking, right? <laughs> it's absolutely hideous. But just so you see what it does, it does, I'm just doing that for you. So let's turn it back to white. So white is always six Fs. And here I have other settings for other visuals. Uh, I have, for example, to add for the table. I have I have some work to do, so I will keep you updated as long when when I update this file, so you can have it too. So let's go back here and bring our whiteness back. And now you can see how it looks. I would love for, you know, to be able to change the lines for the y-axis. I haven't seen that it's possible. If you know how to do it, let me know in the comment box. 
I just doing it manually, which is a pain. And uh, that's all for today. So if you want to know, should I show you very quickly? Uh, you go to curva.com and you log in and then here on the download center, you just go to the members download page and uh, it is on there on a JSON map. So you'll find both, let me show you. So you see, you are going to find um, It's going to be here, and then you will find the JSON file that I show you, a list of the YouTube videos that I have, and then you will have the JSON Power BI file. Uh, you've asked for that, so it's here. Update it at your own risk. I mean, I did it very quickly just to be able to find everything. It's horribly made. I haven't updated since then, but it's in here. If you want to maintain it and fix it, you have all the source files. Everything is in there. Okay, so with that said, I'll see you again on Friday with another DAX Fridays function. Okay, so take care. Bye.